Today, let's work on counting money. How much money is there? Well, the first thing we need to do is identify the coins and the value of each coin. So let's start with our scratch pad. We see here that our first coin is one cent. Well, that's a penny, and a penny is worth one cent. I see another penny, one cent, and another penny is one cent. Well, this next coin looks a little bit different, and if you look right here, you can see it says five cents, which tells me that this is, a, in fact, a nickel. A nickel is worth five cents. And our last one says one dime, and a dime is worth 10 cents. So we're gonna put 10 cents. So now let's count our money together. I like to start with our largest coin, which is 10 cents. So 10 plus five is 15. So I'm gonna cross those out because we counted them. 15 plus one, 16 plus one, 17 plus one, 18. So all of these coins together make 18 cents. Close our scratch pad, 18. That's correct. How much money is there? Let's do that same thing. Let's take this scratch pad. We know that this is one cent. It's a penny, one cent. Another penny is one cent. This next coin, nickel, and a nickel is worth five cents. And our last coin is a dime, and that dime is worth 10 cents. So let's count together. 10 and five, 10 plus five is 15, plus one, 16, one more, 17. So all four of these coins together make 17 cents. Great job. How much money is there? So we have a different coin than we've seen before, but let's start with the one we do. This one says one cent. So that is going to be one cent or a penny. This one says a quarter dollar. So a quarter dollar means that it is a four of them make a dollar and a quarter is worth 25 cents. So 25 cents, 25 cents, 25 cents. So again, we need to count all of these together. I like to start with the biggest one. So 25 plus 25 is going to equal 50 plus 25 more, 75 plus one more, 76. So all four of these coins have a value of 76 cents. That's right. Now, oh, we have a lot more coins on this one. So let's see what the value of these coins are. Let's use that scratch pad to label one cent, one cent for these pennies. Next one is a nickel, five cents. This next coin is a dime, so 10 cents. And the last three are all quarters, so 25 cents, 25 cents, and 25 cents. So let's start by counting. Remember, I said I like to start at the largest coins. So the largest coins here are the quarters. So 25 and 25 is 50, plus 25 more is 75, 10 more, 85, five more, 90, one more, 91, one more, 92. Wow, so all of these coins together make 92 cents. Great job. How much money is there here? So let's use our scratch pad. We know that this is a penny. We said our pennies are worth one cent, another penny worth one cent, another penny worth one cent. And lastly, this one's our quarter, so 25 cents. So now let's count them together. 25, 26, 27, 28. So all four coins equal 28 cents. Oh wow, lots of coins to count on this one. So let's make sure that we label them correctly before we start to count. So this one is one cent, one cent, one cent and another one, that's four pennies. We see we have one, two dimes, so 10 cents and 10 cents. 
and three quarters, one, two, three quarters. So each one of these is 25 cents, 25 cents, and last one is 25 cents. So we can start by counting these up. 25 cents and 25 cents, well that's 50, plus 25 more, 75, plus 10 more, 85, 10 more, 95, one more, 96, one more, 97, one more, 98, and one more, 99 cents. We are one cent away from a dollar, friends, but all together, all of these equal 99 cents. So let's close this, type in 99 cents. Super. All right, we have less coins on this one, so only three. Let's still use that scratch pad. Penny is equal to one cent. A nickel is equal to five cents. And a quarter is equal to 25 cents. So let's count it together. 25 and five, well that makes 30, plus one more is 31. So close that scratch pad, 31 cents. Nice, right, nice job. How much money is there? We have four coins here, so let's use our scratch pad. That's one cent, one cent, five cents for this nickel, and the last one's a dime. If you remember, the dime is 10 cents. So now let's count together. 10 and five, 10 and five make 15, plus one is 16, plus one is 17. So close that scratch pad, type in 17, answer it correctly. How much money is there here? So this one we have a multiple choice, but let's still do the same procedure we did before. Let's use our scratch pad, let's value the coins. A penny is one cent, another penny is one cent, five cents, 10 cents, 25 cents, and another quarter is 25 cents. So now let's count these up together. 25 and 25 is 50, plus 10 more, 60, plus five more, 65, plus one more, 66, plus one more, 67. So close that scratch pad, 67, great job. Last one, how much money is there? Again, this one's multiple choice, but we should work it out just like we needed to find the answer without those options. One cent, one cent, one cent, one cent. So lots of pennies here. This one's a nickel. If you remember, a nickel is five cents. This one's a dime, which is 10. And our last one is a quarter. If you remember, a quarter is 25 cents. So now let's count, 25 and 10 is 35, so cross those out. Five more is 40, plus one, 41, plus one, 42, plus one, 43, plus one, 44. So this would be 44 cents. Nice job, I think we've done a great job counting money today.